we're here with Jen from Just Eat Life and we're gonna make a Swedish apple cake. Apple caca. Apple caca. Stick around. Hello, I'm Adrian, and this is XYXO Cook, the weekly cooking show where we make recipes that make you feel great. And I'm feeling great today because I'm in the house of me, Jen <laughs> from Just Eat Life. And you may remember Jen from our great recipes this past spring. I'll put links to those below if you haven't watched them already. Today we're having an apple party. We're gonna make two recipes, one on her channel and one on this channel. And the one that we're about to make is the Swedish coffee cake, apple caca. Apple caca. Apple caca. It's so funny to say. It's a little risky to say. Yeah. It sounds like caca. Yeah. <laughs> I brought one of my favorite devices over here and it looks a little bit scary. It's like a torture device. But it's an apple peeler core slicer. Oh wait, you said it slices too? This is it, yeah. And it makes a spiral. So these are getting brown already, so we just grabbed a lime out of the fridge. Lemon, lime, what is this? This is lime. a lime. Looks, it's big though. Is it a lemon? It's a lime. No, it's a lime, okay. We have <laughs> cooking shows. <laughs> so <you're too. laughs> Green means lime. And this will keep it from getting too brown. You might want to actually just do the apple later. You're so strong. Unlock it. I know how to use it. One stick of butter plus three tablespoons, and this is really softened. Three quarter cup of sugar. Yeah. Do you have the other kind of attachment? Yeah. The butter's trapped in jail right now. There you go. There we go. Let's try that. Much better. So now that that's combined, we have one and three quarter cup of white flour and two teaspoons of baking powder. Give that a stir. How, how do you cheers in Swedish? Skål! 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 We have two eggs. Put those in. And then two thirds cup of heavy cream or half and half or milk. However decadent you're feeling, we're gonna do half and half because that's what we just found at the CVS on our way over here. Oh shit. What's going on over there? I dropped a shell, so I'm going to use the shell to scoop out the shell, and I save the day. I'm not good at measuring and exactly. This is close enough. Two thirds cup of half and half, and then mix that up. Is that an eggshell on the side over here? If you have any eggshells in there, just go ahead and take those out. So now we're almost done already. So easy. Take a springform pan, we put a little parchment in the bottom. Just pour that shit in here. Give this to your assistant. <laughs> You're making Leo uncomfortable. <laughs> and I'm gonna angle it like this for YouTube, even though this is very awkward. That's how you get that YouTube money. This is not very effective. I could hold it and sit better. I'm no. left-handed. How about I hold it? So easy. You're doing it really hard. I'm not strong enough to bake with you. <laughs> you can give this to your assistant to lick too. How you cheers again? Toodles. Skål. Skål. This last part is the most fun part, but it's also the part that takes patience and meticulousness that we don't possess. Mm -hmm. So luckily we have a famous Swedish cooking assistant here who's very patient and very good at arranging apples. Skål. I hope you have a Swedish assistant in your kitchen. <laughs> you have you don't have one. No, I'm working on that though. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> we can talk about it later. Okay, last step we can do ourselves even if we're not meticulous and patient. <laughs> Sorry, Christian. We're disgracing his family. So now we put it into the oven for 40, this is heavy. What happened? It goes into the oven for 45 minutes at 350. We took it out of the oven and it's been cooling for a while as you can tell by me holding it without being burned right now. Take the springform pan off. I loosened it a little bit with a paper clip. I mean, <laughs> a toothpick. And the parchment makes it very easy to take off. For 
related recipes, please check out, I have a cinnamon roasted apple recipe from last fall that's also delicious. And if you love Swedish cake, one of my most popular videos on this channel is my sw Swedish princess tort cake. That sounds so That you cute. should click on, it's very delicious. And also be sure to check out Jen's channel, Just Eat Life, where we just made some baked, baked brie, brie with, apple. with apples. It's like this, but with cheese. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and leave us a comment about what you're doing about apples this fall. Okay, let's try it. I took a big bite. Scoodles! Scoodles! <laughs> Scoodles! Mm. Mm. All right, well, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon. Bye! Bye. This is really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow.